All right, guys. We are now able to rest a little after the party. Yes. And yeah, we are very grateful also. We are tired. I'm personally tired. He still needs to rest. Yeah, but you guys, you, for example, you've been here now for a month. What, what's your opinion in, Afri in Africa? Or we'll do a special video about that. I will do a special video about it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. And do you feel this is your place? Or do you feel like ah, it's a strange culture as people are drinking from something like this? <laughs> you know? uh, I feel like I still need more time. Okay. Because I've been in the middle of a party, a very unique event, a lot of people. Okay. And I haven't seen a lot of Africa yet, you know? Okay. So, but I want to be with you, that's for sure. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know, mom, uh, in their culture, mm -hmm. you have to hold hands in public to show that you love her or to show like you are with her. Yes. Mm -hmm. But in Africa, we don't do that. Yes. People will be like, hey, mm -hmm. now it's really conflicting because sometimes she thinks I am not, <laughs> I don't love her. No, it's not that I, don't, I, I think that you don't love me, but I'm very used that we show affection yeah. everywhere. In okay. our privacy and even in public, it's okay to show it because it's, if, if you hold my hand in public, you are telling the world that I'm your woman, you know? Okay. And from our side, if you don't do that, I can get offended. Like, I was feeling offended the first day, <laughs> to be honest. I didn't know why he would be so shy. And I was like, what's going on? And then he told me. So and I then to I told record. him also. <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah. Because it's very, it's very normal for us to show. It's not that we are kissing or doing things that we, you should do inside of a room, right? But at least uh, hugging, holding hands, holding hands especially, you know? Woman and man, when you are a couple, you hold hands. Oh, yes, yes. Guys, for those who are in my YouTube channel, I'm trying to... I was telling my mom, yeah. Rocio wants me to hold her hand. Because in their culture, that's a way of showing affection or love. In public, like outside walking. Yeah. She was getting really offended that I was not doing that, like the first day. Now I'm explaining that to my mom, if my mom would understand. <laughs> mom, what do you think? Holding hands in public or no? No, it's not allowed. Most in, in Africa here, yeah. uh -huh. you see people who are not brought in such a way. They yeah. were not brought, they didn't bring up their children that way. Mm -hmm. So when they see people holding hands, they tend to ask, what's wrong? Uh -huh. Oh, this one comes from the other nation, that's why she's holding uh -huh. hands. But what do you think about me and Marwa holding hands? Because it's part of my culture and I also want to, I want to celebrate that. What do you think about that? <laughs> in public. Yes. In public, <laughs> yeah. Remember in public, people, people not like it. But I like it. <laughs> I like it and for me it's very important. Yeah, it's culture show kids here. Yeah. Very hard. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay. But for me, you know, for me. Privacy. Uh-huh. No, but holding hands, there's nothing wrong about holding hands. It's just holding a hand. You hold hands here to say hello, hello, you touch the hands of when the When walking people. or when you are in the room. When you are in the room, there's no problem, but outside. But when you are in the room, you go to another level of intimacy. <laughs> outside, holding hands is more than okay. And actually, for me, that's a, that's a must. It's very important because if he doesn't show me affection, I will feel... Uh, like neglected. he neglected, okay. and I will leave. <laughs> you will leave, hey. <laughs> guys. You've not reached there. <laughs> yes. So I, see I think it's important that if you want to be with a woman from a different culture, you need to also <laughs> adapt some things from my culture because I am here adapting a lot of things from your culture. What do you think? Like which one? My mama help. 
like like it's some like some of things of from my culture yeah, I'm explaining to my mom like you have to hold uh, you know, holding you see yeah uh, here you hold a small baby yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh, who, who does not know the way uh-huh. but grown ups here in Kenya, yeah. you walk tough, tough, tough. Yeah. But it's for affection. No, but it's for affection. A it's couple okay. that is in love, yes, you hold okay. hands, you touch each other, you, you, you uh, take care. It's nurturing. That's, oh, that's how you nurturing. nurture the love. Yeah. Yes. Okay, okay. If you don't touch each other, it doesn't look like you are a, a couple. But and they I, don't look like a couple, they don't look like a, they are in love. You think they love each other, they don't look like they love each other, you know? Wow. That's why it's so important for us to to show... If, because if you don't touch each other in public, it's like you're hiding. Yeah. So what, why are you hiding? <laughs> because you don't want people to show that, you know? That's, our, that's the way that we see it. I love it. <laughs> yeah. You see, that, like now, <laughs> yeah, well, in fact, uh, here in Africa, have yeah. you ever seen anybody even yeah, yeah, the yeah. top? That's the question. Even, that's, even the, that's the question. Are you seeing, are you seeing the, like the press? Uh, uh, have you ever seen them holding, holding their wives? Hands. No, no they don't. No, and it's, it's for don't. me, I don't like it because it, it doesn't look like they don't love each other. Or they don't. Or, or in this party, did, you, or see, they did you see any people, holding apart from hands. at night? Maybe. Yeah. At night, people hold hold. But during the day, no. No. it means that people here are busy. Uh-huh. They don't have time. No, it's not like no, that. They but they hide. Know. They hide. It looks like they hide. Why are they hiding? If they are like the official partners, you know? When if mm. this is so this that official one, it, yeah. that, that one is strict situation, but if yeah. you marry if you marry Maru officially yeah. and uh, you are obtained by marriage, then you will hold your hands. Uh, <laughs> yes. oh, that, that's comes. a tricky situation. <laughs> yes, that's that's a tricky situation. My, my mom comes to the condition. <laughs> I'm repeat one more time. Yes, I'm saying if you yeah. you wait with Marwa, uh-huh. then everybody accepts you and the whole the entire community, then you will hold the hands. Uh-huh. Yes, for mm. hey. yes, yes. Hey. Okay, okay. Me, I'm flowing, guys. The way it's coming. I don't know. I need to receive a proposal. I haven't received any proposal. So. Don't say like that. <laughs> Just make yourself comfortable. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and in my culture also, we don't get married so fast. How it's long, in, it's, how it's long that, that you take? Because it's, age, it's not a age, time. Age, like now, yeah. Ma- Ma- Mara needs to get married because age is, uh-huh. is pushing him. But he's not going to die tomorrow. He still, he still have a long life to live. You see, yeah. you see, here in Africa, uh-huh. you have to go with age. Yeah. When you delay getting children yeah. and getting married, yeah. you, will, you will regret it later. You uh-huh. wasted your time when you were young. Yeah. You want to bring up your children when you are working with a stick. Yeah. That one cannot all go away. Uh-huh. So you need and to... And what happened here, for example, uh, you need to be married first and then children, or uh, children can come either, before? Either way, either way. You can, you people, can actually, most of the time it. is to get married and have children. Yes. yes. But sometimes people get children before getting married, uh-huh. then marry even later. Uh-huh. So I've seen, I've seen some couples that maybe because of Congress marriage... Congress mom is falling asleep. <laughs> Not really. No, you see... What do you want first? A, a children or marriage? Either, but uh, it's good. For me, I prefer children. Uh-huh. Children first? Because yeah. marriage is just a day or two. But children is just... They are there they are so there. that you bring them up when you are still strong. Uh-huh. When you wait up to the late age, you re- regret. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, you see, it depends how old are you. Yeah. Like Mara, you told me when you'd be 30, free. Mama. <laughs> now you'll be getting married. Oh, mama, don't yeah. give her pressure. <laughs> yes, I must give pressure. Because of years. Time is going. Oh, mama. No. It will happen the right <laughs> How time. How about you? I feel like God has his own timing for everything. And time is divine. When, you know, it, it, we, it, it, we it, say, it. we say, I, I also have my own age, you know. 
for, for the moment where I want to have children, for the moment where I want to become a mom also. Yes. But, but also in my culture, for example me, I have a lot of dreams that I want to reach before becoming a mom. Because for me, becoming a mom changed my entire life. It changed my body, it changed the, my responsibilities, and, and I also have a lot of things that I want to do before taking care of someone, the way that I want to take care of my children, and also the way that I want to raise my children, and, and many, many things. So mm. that's also for me, my own timing is important. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yeah. she has explained. Yeah. Now, Rocio, uh -huh. uh, it's important that uh, you, you have told me mm -hmm. about your responsibility, yeah. about uh, uh, what you want to accomplish, your dreams, yeah. to meet your dreams before you take care of your family. Yeah. Now, uh, with us here in Africa, mm -hmm. when somebody reaches if you are a girl and you yeah. reach 30, yeah. uh, 30 downwards uh, below, yeah. then you are at a good age. But uh, above 30, yeah. people start now for, forgetting about your marriage. Uh -huh. That's true. They uh -huh. start now forgetting that you don't even have children. They start now forgetting you uh -huh. in the lineage of family. Uh -huh. So family with us here starts from 18 up to... Thirty, mm -hmm. yes, downwards. Okay. Below, mm -hmm. from thirty and above, you are late. Uh -huh. uh, because imagine you are thirty, then uh, you get married. Maybe you get married when you are thirty-five. Yeah. Now, at twenty years, Sasa, then you are. You see, when you are a child now, will be twenty. How uh -huh. old will you be? Fifty-five. Yeah. Fifty-five. Uh -huh. Sasa, that's the latest person who got married yeah. late. Yeah. But if you go to 45, you go to 50, then you, you cannot give birth. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm the youngest of six, and my mom had me when she was 44 years old. 45? 44. 44. Okay, 44. Okay, yes. Ah, she had six, six kids. The first one, she was 22 years old. And the last one, she was 22 years older. Hey, you yeah. see people are different. Yeah. Uh, people are different and the type of food also affects yes. lineage. So it yeah. is different. Yeah. So here in Africa we are saying that the girl should get married when you are eighteen up to thirty mm -hmm. final. Then when you, you are a man, thirty five Musho. Mm -hmm. Musho so, is end. End. Yeah. Man, man is thirty five. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. so when you when I you go beyond have, that, then you are lost. I still have to then you are lost. Yes. <laughs> totally lost. Why is totally, totally lost. Totally lost. Uh, totally lost. <laughs> yes. Guys, I still, at least I have two more years before I get lost. <laughs> no, 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 no. We don't want to get lost. No, I'm not getting lost, man. Well, you must get a, a children as early as possible. Okay. Yes. Now you know you are telling mom. Mom, yeah. I don't have a baby. I don't have a place. Now you have a place. Where is the place? But everything came in the perfect timing. Do you allow polygamy yeah. in your culture? No. Polygamy. No. Do you, you allow it? No. Why? No, it's not. It's not. It's not allowed. Even if you are not giving birth, no. No. Even if you don't get children, no. No. Hey, your culture is different. Yeah, we are. If you get married with someone, you can only get married with one person. And and it's not allowed by the law, no. Oh, the and law if law. you if you wanna get married with someone different, mm. first you need to divorce, mm. and after the divorce, mm. it's it's right under the law. Then you can get married again with someone else, but it's monogamous relationships. But what about energy. people who have relationships that they are not public? But that, but that is no. But when it comes to a secret. Mm -hmm. Relationship with someone else that is cheating. That is cheating. Oh. If if the if both parts are not uh, doesn't know about mm -hmm. that there is someone else you know that is a third party that is cheating. The, now now there is some relationships some couples that they accept uh, open relationships 
Yeah, and date, dating some polygamy, like dating polygamy. some yeah but but polygamy here is not it's just the men allowing to be, have more than wife it's not the woman being able to have more than one man it's just the men it's just a, it's just a benefit for the men here. you know it's it's men who determines uh, children okay Their children the man has to determine that that's why uh -huh. can, this cannot get children with his wife Uh -huh. Gets another woman, then gets children. Uh -huh. Marriage is for. Uh, for Continued. Continued. <laughs> uh -huh. To have offspring. Yes. 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 That's why you go for marriage, not for leisure. No, and no, in for us, we we get married because of love. Leisure. If you love, love. if you for love, Amor. if you're in love, yes, yes. No. Hey guys, my battery uh, got too hot and my camera shut down, but hey, that was a tough conversation, huh? It continue, but it's not gonna be on my video. Mara was able to record the rest. <laughs> but I think those conversations are very important in terms of uh, cultural shocks, right? I want to leave my shoes here because I, I need to walk barefoot. Uh, all right, guys. I'm like <laughs> conversation, tough conversation, but I think it's very important also to share those things because when we come from different cultures, we grow with, with different normal. You know, and my normal is not their normal, and and what is normal f uh, for people here is a big, big shock for me. Actually, I want to come show you this tree because I love it. And what is normal for me is completely different. Things that here are normal in my society, we don't allow it. We don't, we don't even think about it. That's like a crazy, crazy thing. Guys, I love this tree so much. It's very beautiful. I love that he's like very big in here, you know? Um, but yeah, what it's for, for me, um, I've been receiving many questions since I came here about these topics and all of these things. But for me, that's not normal. And I just can't change my mind from one day to another just because I'm in a different culture. And also, and when you go somewhere new with a different, different, different culture, um, the fact that I'm here doesn't mean that I, I will just forget everything. I will unlearn everything that is actually in my subconscious mind because I've been learning these things as normal since I was born, it doesn't mean that I will change from one day to another and be someone different that accepts everything as normal because for to believe that something is normal, you must see it regularly in your life. Polygamy for me is not normal. It's not even allowed by the law in my country. In my country, you can't have multiple wives, you know? Uh, so that's not even, it's not that it's even like, it's not normal. It's like crazy because I was born and I've been raised in a society where you want one partner for the rest of your life. Like pigeons. Pigeons, they choose one partner for their entire life and that's it you know <laughs> so that's the normal thing for me and and yeah but it's nice to have these conversations it's also nice to understand the whys why people um, have these concepts in the way that they build their family I can see that African culture is very, very strict. I think I haven't been in a culture that is as strict 
as Africans in terms of creating and building family. I now I can understand more the reasons. They have they have reasons. It's not just because they decide things. They they purely have reasons and we don't have those reasons in where I come from. Uh, I think also we we flow in a different in a different way. But it's nice to learn. That's the, this is the magic about traveling and getting to know different cultures, getting to know different places. Um, I mean, I'm in a place where everything is absolutely new for me because there there's a very minimum percent of the things that I I'm living now, the way that I'm living now, that are similar to what I'm used to, you know? So, and if I'm here, it's because I'm also, I'm choosing to be here, but I also, I come with a mindset already that, I've, of course, I don't, I don't have the pressure. I'm not here and it's because I'm here, I must change, right? Because nobody is pressuring me. Marwa has chosen me for who I am, understanding my backgrounds, understanding that I have different beliefs also, and he likes that. Otherwise, otherwise he would have chosen an African woman from the village that can follow all of these rules, but he likes different also. He is different. And he needs different so but I guess we are both learning because of course I come with with um, I forgot the word right now but I, I also I come with conditions you know uh, and if I also <laughs> this is the funny part you know uh, he knows everything of course we, we we talk about these things already but we are still learning in the process you know some things you cannot just just know you need to live it to live to understand it to process and also processing takes time you know it's not nothing just happened from one day to another and and yeah, <laughs> but it was really nice to have that conversation. Also good for me to be able to open myself in what is it that I want, because I also choose. I also have power of decision. I also, uh, I also have my, my own desires in the way that I want to build my life, build my relationship, build my future family i also come with conditions i also have belief that are important for me and that i want to follow so but i love new also i love getting to understand why people think different than me you know because when i get to see these things I understand, you know, because there's so many things about my own culture that I don't, I don't feel like it's okay, and I would like to see different. So God listens to me, and He brought me to a very, very different. I know I'm here because of a reason, you know. For me, everything has a purpose. Everything has a reason, and and I'm I'm, I'm very heart opened and willing to learn and take what I need and the rest I, I can leave it. That's the way that you, that's the way that, uh, a, a nice way to live life. And yeah, I can see the boys, the boys having, what are you preparing guys here? African food. African food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, every day I am learning more and more and more about African culture. Hello, Maouida, how are you? I am fine. You're good? Yeah, today I'm Hello. a special chef. 
You are the chef today? No, we are the chef. Well, you are the chef, yeah. all of you together. Yes. Okay, that's nice. What are you doing? We are cooking a very Here we are cooking a, a, a meal. It's a, you know, in Kenya we have some com different communities in Kenya. Yeah. And uh, one of the biggest communities here in Kenya is called Kikuyu. Kikuyu, yeah. yes. Okay, I come from a like, I'm come from a Meru community, but I'm more into Kikuyu for culture. Okay, I heard that in Kikuyu, my name means tomorrow. Uh, yeah, like Roshio. Roshio. Roshio means Roshio. tomorrow. <laughs> it means tomorrow. It means tomorrow. Yeah. So I've been. Here. I came here in the morning just to say yeah. hi to you guys, but uh, I just found myself cooking now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I. I and I it's the, almost like what time is it? Like four, so, four so or almost, almost uh, five. <laughs> Guys, it is 5.10. 5.10, alright. Yeah. So, yeah. I, uh, what I, you I, I found some maize inside your kitchen. Yeah. And then I saw that the leaves were drying up. So I knew yeah. that these maize were not going to be good. Then we were with the lady who is... The, ma the maize. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. So I, I dressed them. Uh, yeah. Together with the uh, Marwa painter. We dressed uh -huh. them. And then uh, the lady who is helping in cleaning. Yes. She had put some beans on. That's how the meal came about to be. So, uh -huh. here we are having some... Uh, okay. You can come close and show them. That's uh, beans, beans and, and maize. And maize. And then down there we have some potato, Irish potatoes. Okay. With pumpkin leaves. Okay. Then uh, I have covered them with gideri. We call it gideri. Uh huh. Uh, so the the thing that is gonna fall up is just after they are ready. Yeah. I mash them. Yeah. And then after I mash them, it's gonna the food is gonna be, turn color. It's gonna be somehow green. Okay. And then after that. I'm gonna now fry it. Oh wow! It's gonna be delicious. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna be able to try that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna love it. Gonna okay. Love it. Yeah. So How is this called? Yeah. It has a name. What this one. The yeah, the food, the meal that you're doing. The meal is called mukimo. Mukimo. Or mataha. Mataha. In Kikuyu. Okay. And now we are using the African pot. Yes. And the advantage of cooking with this pot, yes. uh, one of one of it, uh, the mineral is uh, when you're cooking and in case I happen to go, and then this yeah. fire is not gonna be up. Yeah. This one is is, is gonna retain the heat. The, it's gonna retain the heat. Yes. And then another thing, this one also, also helps in retaining the taste of the food. Uh huh. Yeah, that's the main main purpose of it. And then that's it good. cooks also fast. It cooks fast. The food just cooks here. Yeah. At good pace. Yeah. yeah. And it's in it's a slow cook or is fast it's a slow cook but very efficient okay yeah yeah so that's the advantage of cooking with this one and um i hope like you're gonna love the food man uh -huh. uh, the, i just wish you can get some avocado from somewhere oh, okay this food goes well with uh, an accompaniment of uh, uh, avocado. An avocado yeah yeah i wish like you can get one oh, okay maybe, maybe you can make even a guacamole with it man uh -huh. something else <laughs> so guys yeah. in case watching this video my amazing name is only mawera the clay boy but now you know the career can shift at any time mm -hmm. i'm a man of very many talent and uh right now i'm cooking yeah check me out on youtube as only mawera m-a-w-i-r-a and i have my amazing team here which is supporting yes me. <laughs> are you single mawera i'm very much single girl. you're very single are you single guys have um, <laughs> yeah very much very much because <laughs> yes, yeah. you know what we were having a conversation yeah. with Mara yeah. and congress mom yeah about polygamy right because here it's very normal for you right exactly you do you have the desire of having many wives no no, no. for me i just feel like uh, one wife is gonna be enough for me uh -huh. because uh, i want uh, my kids to have the best life yeah and i don't my but i don't want to have a divided attention Oh. I just want to give it to my kids and my wife. And nice. I, want to be a dad. I am Team Nawira. <laughs> I am Team Nawira. <laughs> yes. What right. about you guys? At first, I'm the grandfather of the guest board. <laughs> now, <laughs> uh, actually, even to me, I like. I don't like polygamy. Okay. I like a single one. Okay. Um, it becomes very easy to sustain and feed, okay. you know. Okay, yeah. Uh, that's very, very good. Uh -huh. Yes, yeah, I go by the name Pablo Jr. And uh -huh. the junior is JNR on YouTube. Uh -huh. Right now, the Gazebo, we shall continue the progress of it, I hope. Okay, All right. okay. Doctor? Yeah, uh, what's up, guys? This is Why Not Kibe, the doctor around. Yeah. And um, me too, I, I don't really, uh, I'm not really into polygamy. Wow, guys, I'm so impressed because I, I wasn't <laughs> expecting this from. I was just expecting, yes, I want five, I want six, I want ten, <laughs> you know? And wow, I'm happy now. <laughs> you know, polygamy is, is, is it was a thing of the past. Okay. Maybe because they thought, I don't know why, but it was a thing of the past. 
Uh -huh. But right now, it's good to concentrate on your family. And yeah. having a family, it's good to have just one family so yeah. that you can concentrate on your family and focus on that family. Okay. So even the economy cannot allow you to have more than two wives right now, uh -huh. more than one wife, uh -huh. because it's quite, the economy is quite harsh right now. Uh -huh. okay. So for me, I really prefer one. Yeah. So that's, uh, and in case, for example, because you know, in my culture, yeah. polygamy is not allowed, like legally. You know, yeah. uh, there's some like couples that they decide to have a, a open relationship and date many people. But this polygamy is also allowed for the woman, for the woman to date other men. You know, it's oh. not like yeah, that's polygamy for, for right. us. Like right. poly, it's from both sides. So they can date more people, but it, um, in terms of law yeah. and marriage. You can you can marry just one person. If you want to marry someone else, you have to divorce first, and then you can get married once again. But it's not allowed. So for me, it's not normal. It's not normal at all. For me, it's like crazy. You're right. And also, I grew up with this desire of having a man that wants to be only with me. You know, like I want to sleep with my man every single day. I don't want to share my man. You know, that's a. It's, it's like. I'm trying to understand their <laughs> point of view and, and now I'm learning the whys yeah. behind. Yeah. But for me, I, I already told Mara that one of my, my, <laughs> my, yeah, my rules yeah. is it's only me. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You know, one is it's easy to focus on one person. Exactly. Yeah. Because the divided attention will now bring a lot of issues. Yeah. Conflicts, and, you know. Yeah. 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 And and conflicts. Conflicts. Exactly. The good wife yeah. and the other way. Yes. You know, like, because Congre Mom was saying that uh, there are re there are relationships with many wives and they all live together very well. They don't fight, and I can believe that. Yeah, probably that happened. Okay, there are some people that there are some communities which which it works. Yeah. And uh, actually, I can give an example. There's a guy here in Tanzania. He has three wives. Uh -huh. Three wives, and uh, they live happily. Uh -huh. But, yeah, only, but exactly. I guess for now, I guess everything is changing. You know, the world is changing. There's yeah. a guy in Western who has 26 wives. Ah. Even wow. at the village, and more than 100 kids. Exactly. Wow. And they had the village people are polygamy. You know, yeah. this polygamy traditionally was like for prestigious reasons. You know, yeah. and richness. Like when you yeah. have many children, you yeah. are regarded as rich. Yeah. But right now, uh -huh. ah, no, no, no. Yeah, no. but you know, also the problems <laughs> I, I've, I have found yeah. in this is like, for example, grand. Uh, the, I am Marwa's grandfather. He yeah. has like 100 uh, grandchildren, <laughs> and I believe that even if I believe that these these kids, yeah. they have no idea who is his grandfather. Yeah. Oh, how you how can you remember 100 names? Okay. You, know? Brothers, you, you know, you know, your brothers. It becomes very difficult. <laughs> you can even marry them by <laughs> For example, I'm I know you that happened. I will tell you, I will yeah. tell you one case that happened to me. Yeah. When I was getting in Form 1, like Form 1 the here is when after you now go to the high school. Yeah. I was in Form 1, then I, I happened to go to a certain high school. And then during the games, because you have to have inter-schools inter games, I met one lady, she was very beautiful, and I approached her. Uh -huh. And then after we exchanged the contact, then when we went home for the whole day, I was like, can we link up? She told me where, where I'm gonna get her. Shockingly, when I, where I went to meet her, it was my grandfather and my grandmother's place. And I was uh -huh. like, what are you doing here? She this is my grandmother. <laughs> I swear to God. Oh my God. God. I swear, to, even I can call her right now. Her name is Tuahira. I was like, like you, are my you are my, we are relatives, and I was shocked, to be honest. <laughs> so you can even find yourself marrying your own relative. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. That's the disadvantage yeah. of poly being polygamous. Yeah. Uh -huh. yes. Yes. And you know, during the past, the, 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 the male or the man of the house, they usually have this power that yes. they can control their Male chauvinism. Yeah. So you can't even complain that, no, don't add another. So the, the yes. man who just come and they another wife, he said, this, yeah. yeah. this is your partner. You yes. have a partner, you have nothing yeah. to say. And wow. say. The male chauvinism, wow. like it was totally... Now, in this case, Marwa told me when we had these conversations, right? Yeah. Marwa told me that it would be only if I allow. He, that he can have another another yeah. woman yeah. only if allow. I allow. Yeah. Yeah. But for me, it's a no already. It's a no. Bang! Put a big padlock. Put a big X. Big X, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And also, you know, also because in in my culture, yeah. also when you are with someone, it's first because you fall in love with that person. Yeah, exactly. Do you think that also? You can fall in love with two people at the same time and love them at the same at the same level. No, I think if you if you love someone, you love that one particular person. But now, uh -huh. if you love another person, to mean the love of the other one has disappeared. 
you now love the new person. That's so. that's also my like my exactly. part of the my degree of love. The degree of love. You don't, yeah. You don't like this other one. You want yeah. another one. Exactly. So you find yeah. someone more beautiful than exactly. that. Than yeah. 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 So and also changes. for me, this thing about sleeping together, for example, if I decide that I have a, I want to have my husband. I don't want to find myself one a few days in the week where I'm sleeping alone. Yeah. No, that's I find it so sad. It means like sleeping for me is a big case. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah, because you know when you sleep with someone is is your partner. You know that it's a very important thing. The yeah. one, the person that you share your bed with. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. and in terms of yeah, just imagine myself. Oh, today I sleep alone because my man is. Having yeah, sex with another woman, <laughs> it looks no? very weird. It becomes very <laughs> weird. And for this, for you, uh, yeah. Rocio, uh, maybe you can tell him to take you around the village. There are some places where you're gonna, when you get to the, to the homestead, you're gonna see the house. You're gonna be told this is a house for the first life, second life. Maybe they live the same. The courier yeah. setup yeah. at the yeah. village. The courier yeah. setup. You should look for that content. Uh -huh. You can have a very good picture of how it looks like now. You can exactly. have a picture. Now you can imagine. Yeah. Today he's in that house. Yes. Uh -huh. The bed of that house is shaking. Uh -huh. And I'm here in the cold alone. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes even exactly. they, 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 they have time. They have yeah. like time table. Wow. Time. From 7 to 9 in the first house. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if I'm learning something about the African culture, it's your very structure yeah. It, yeah. in things should be done this, like yeah. this, yeah. and yeah. like yeah. this. The protocol. Yeah. 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 Have to be but the world is changing. The world yeah. is changing. So that's it. Right yeah. now, you cannot, it's very rare to find polygamy or such things because people are changing their mentality. Yeah. No, I at the village yeah. there is polygamy. I'm, I'm the, I'm the neighbor here. I yes. know that they are, it's poly, people are polygamy, but they but have two wives. Father and a great, uh -huh. great, great, great no, no, no. even a young it, guy. Exactly, even oh, the people who are, at, yeah, young exactly. Guy more than one wife. And people who are even at Mara Sage. Yeah. You may find them, they have two wives. Uh -huh. Okay, maybe you can take a that person, then they talk, they but explain how they But it's very live. hard, they can never come there, you know. <laughs> <laughs> to convince those people, it's very hard. Like, uh -huh. You find those yeah. are really traditional, they're still yes. based on their mentality on exactly. traditional yes. beliefs. Uh -huh. and so, which, yeah. that you're out of that. As you're in 2020. But it's oh. not bad. Polygamous as, is not bad. As for me, I believe, eh? Yeah. yeah. Uh, we, there's a thing in, in, a, in, a, in a Swahili that says, Kwena kwingi kwana mengi, which means going yeah. many places, it helps you sing, I see a lot a of lot. stuff. Uh -huh. And uh, as for me, I can say like if you haven't, if you have been traveling around the world, at least you have seen, you have seen a lot, a lot of stuff. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, learn and adapt to them. You know, the, the world yeah. is changing right now. Yeah. We are not in the past. Yeah. So as for me, I believe in one, uh, one way. And that is it. Do you but feel the smoke? Uh, yeah, it's that's coming. Now <laughs> being, that's now African. Yeah. Africa. You yeah. must yeah. not feel the smoke. <laughs> yes, that's not. You must be the smelling kitchen, smoke. Yeah. The yeah. Where there is smoke, uh, the food yeah. must be there. Must be there. <laughs> yeah. yes. you know, it's yeah. very funny at the African place. Like when I was very young, yeah. when I could see just smoke at the neighbor's place, yeah. I know that now it's lunch time. It's lunch time. <laughs> Our yeah. children yeah. could gather. <laughs> time to eat. <laughs> that's actually yeah. nice. Yes, it's a so nice. So nice. Okay, guys, I'm very impressed. I'm very in a positive in a positive way because yeah. because okay that's that's at least for me it's yeah. nice to see yeah. that uh, yeah, things are changed yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's not very very um, uh, close-minded you know yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, a thing yeah. I can see that young people is also is thinking different yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I don't say that it's bad, right? It's, bad. it's just, it's, it's just, it's not normal for me, yeah. and it's not what I, it's not what I want. Yeah. That's it's for sure. It's not fair to the, to the, to the woman of the house. It's not fair to the lady. Yeah, it's yeah. not fair to the lady. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the man might feel I think, pride. I and think, some yeah, that, exactly. And yes, that's why like I tell it brings yeah. prestigious. It could be prestigious yeah. for prestige reasons. Yeah, it's, but it's, it's, it's also oppressing the female. Yeah. That's why you're oppressing the females yeah. because you say you can't say anything. I'm the one who decides what to do. And wow. I guess, and I guess wow. that uh, it's good, like when you're dating someone, wow. you tell them, you be honest with them, tell them openly your yes. heart, how you feel. Yeah. So that you, when you're making the final decision, are you ready for this person? You can know. Yeah. Yeah. It becomes very easy. Yeah, yeah. So 